definitions of a sequence. So what is sequence? A sequence is a set of numbers arranged in a particular order such that each number can be derived from the previous number according to the certain rules. For example, first Romans here, negative 5, negative 3, negative 1, 1, 3, 5, and so on. For the second Romans, we have negative 1, 1, negative 3, 3, negative 5, 5, and so on. And for third Romans, we have 3, 3, 3, 3, 3, and so on. Each number of a sequence is called a term. Here is a sequence, 3, 5, 7, 9, and so on. 3 is the first term, 5 is the second term, 7 is the third term, 9 is the fourth term, and 3 dots means goes on forever, which is infinite. And you must know that terms, element, or num members mean the same things. Next, the notations TN represent the n terms or general terms of a sequence. That means for the first terms is 3, you can write as T1 equal to 3. 5, for the second terms, you can write T2 equal to 5. Third terms is 7, you can write as T3 equal to 7s. For the fourth terms here is 9s, you can write T4 equal to 9 and so on. Now, let's look at the definitions of an aromatic sequence. So, an aromatic sequence is a sequence of number in which any terms differs from the previous terms by a certain number. The difference between consecutive terms is called the common difference of a sequence. So, if the first term is A and the common difference is D, then the aromatic sequence is A, A plus D, A plus 2D, A plus 3D, and so on, until the last terms A plus N minus 1D. Based on this sequence, you can have the first terms T1 equal to A here, the second terms T2 equal to A plus D here, which is equal to A plus 2 minus 1 times t, the third terms, which is t3 equal to a plus 2d, from here, equal to a plus 3 minus 1d, and so on. Therefore, the n terms, the n terms of an aromatic sequence is given by this formula, okay, which is tn equal to a plus n minus 1 times d. Next, how to find the common difference? You can have D equal to Tn minus Tn minus 1. For examples, you can have D equal to T2 minus T1. Or we can have D equal to T3 minus T2. Also, you can have D equal to T4 minus T3. And the list goes on. Now, we already know the formula that can be used to find the n terms of an aromatic sequence and the common difference. So, the formula that can be used to find the n terms of an aromatic sequence is Tn equal to a plus n minus 1 times t. And to find the common difference, you can use d equal to Tn minus Tn minus 1. So now, let's look at example 1. Given the aromatic sequence 7, 13, 19, so on, until the last term 307. Find the first Romans here, the number of terms. Second Romans, the 20th terms. And the third Roman, the end terms of the aromatic sequence. 
let's focus on the questions for the first Romans, the number of terms. That means you need to find N. Before that, you, can, you must take out the information given from the aromatic sequence here. So you can have A equal to 7 from here. And the common difference D by taking the second terms minus the first terms, which is you can have 13 minus 7. So 13 minus 7 equal to 6. You also have the last terms here, which is Tn equal to 307. And you need to find N. So you can apply this formula to find n since we already have the information for tn the first terms a and the common difference d okay i will rewrite that formula tn equal to a plus n minus 1 times d and you can substitute all the informations you have gathered here so the last term is 307 equal to first terms a which is 7 plus n minus 1 times the common difference which is 6 okay first i will expand this part okay n minus 1 times 6 and i will bring 7 to the left hand side so you have 307 minus 7 equal to 6n minus 6 okay we will have 300 on the left hand side equal to 6n minus 6 i will bring 6n to the left hand side and 300 to the right hand side so we will have negative 6n equal to negative 6 minus 300 so we have 6n equal to 306 and equal to 51. Therefore, you can write conclusions. Therefore, number of terms is 51. So now let's focus on questions to Roman. Find the 20th term. That means you need to find. T20. So here the information you have gathered before and to find T20 you need to apply this formula Tn equal to A plus N minus 1 times T. So you have T20 which is 20 here is the value of N. So T20 equal to A plus N minus 1 which is 20 minus 1 times d okay you can substitute the value of a and d based on these informations which is t20 equal to a7 plus 20 minus 1 is 19 times 6 equal to 121 therefore t20 equal to 121 now, let's focus on question 3 Roman. Find the n terms of the aromatic sequence. That means you need to find Tn in terms of n. So, how to find Tn in terms of n is you need to apply this formula. Tn equal to A plus n minus 1 times D. Then, you can substitute the value of a and d in this formula which is you will get 7 plus n minus 1 times 6 next you must expand this part so we have 7 plus 6n minus 6 and then simplify which is we can take 7 minus 6 equal to 1 plus 6n Therefore, Tn equal to 1 plus 6n. Example 2. 
The 11 terms of an aromatic sequence is 52 and the 90th terms is 92. Find A. The first terms and common difference. B. 100 terms. Before you can answer question A and B, you need to take out the information given in these questions. So the first information is 11 terms is 52 and the second information is 90th terms is 92. So we can have T11 equal to 52 and T19 equal to 92. Let's look at question A just now, which is find the first terms and the common difference. That means you need to find the value of A and D. So need to have at least two equations in order to find the value of A and D. So we have these two equations here. You just need to write these two equations in the form of this formula, Tn equal to A plus N minus 1 times T to have A and D. So now, for the first equations here, we have A plus n minus 1 which is 11 minus 1 is 10 times t equal to 52 as the first equations next we have a plus n minus 1 which is 19 minus 1 is 18 times t equal to 92 next i will eliminate uh, a by taking equations 2 minus equations 1. So equations 2 minus equations 1, you will have a minus a equal to 0, 18d minus 10d equal to 8d, next equal to 92 minus 52 equal to 40. So, D equal to 40 divided by 8, which is D equal to 5. Next, we can take 5 here, D equal to 5, to be substituted into equations 1 or equations 2 to get the value of A. So, I will substitute into equations 1. Okay, we have A plus 10 times D equal to 52. So A equal to 52 minus 50. So A equal to 2. Therefore, A equal to 2 and D equal to 5. Next, let's answer questions B, which is finds 100 terms. That means you need to find T100. So now you know that 100 is N. So T100 equal to, okay, substitute into this formula, the value of N here, and we already have the value of A and D just now. So we have T100 equal to A2 plus and minus 1, which is 100 minus 1 times D, which is 5. Okay, so the answer is 497. Example 3. The n terms of an aromatic sequence is given by Tn equal to 40 plus 7n. A. Find the common difference b which terms of the sequence is 215 first you need to take out the information given which is you have the n terms of an aromatic sequence is tn equal to 40 plus 7n question a find the common difference that's me you need to find the value of d and we know that to find the value of D, you can use this formula which is Tn minus Tn minus 1. For example, you can use D equal to T11 
T2 minus T1. The first terms minus, sorry, the second terms minus the first terms. Or you can have T3 minus T2 or T4 minus T3 and so on. Okay, let's say we want to find the value of the common difference by using T2 minus T1. First, you need to find the value of the second terms and the first terms. So to find the value of the second terms and the first term, you can apply these informations, which is we can have n equal to 1 and to be substituted in this informations, which is we have t1 equal to 40 plus 7 times 1 equal to 47. Next, we can have t2, which is by taking n equal to 2 and substitute also in this formula. We have t2 equal to 40 plus 7 times 2 equal to 54. So now, you can have d equal to the second terms minus the first term is 54 minus 47 equal to 7. Therefore, the common difference is 7. For question B, which terms of the sequence is 215? That means you have Tn equal to 215 and you need to find the value of n. Okay, so we have Tn equal to 215 and we also have this information which is Tn equal to 40 plus 7n. So you can substitute 40 plus 7n here. We have 40 plus 7n equal to 215. So 7n equal to 215 minus 40 is 175. So n equal to 25. Please write the conclusions, which is therefore the 25th terms is 215.